Okay, I am wrapping up a showing, but this is honestly one of the coolest 102 year old homes that I've ever seen, I've ever shown. I've got some really nice friends in here looking at this house now. I told them I'd try to keep them out of the video. 845 Edgewood Drive. An absolute treat. I'm gonna, this is gonna be a very fast video. Uh, it's gonna be detailed, but it's gonna be on the quicker side. So there's storage here, two car garage, there's an apartment above here. It's got a screen pool. The truck does not come with the house, but just doesn't that fit? This home has got all the charm, uniqueness, and well-kept uppedness, if that's a word you can ever imagine. So check this out when you first walk in. The beautiful smell, even. Look at these arches. I mean, seriously, if you're watching this video, I hope you enjoy this and you can see as much of this as I'm seeing because it's seriously, it's absolutely gorgeous. The courtyard, I'm gonna take you right into here. The spiral staircase. All right, I'm gonna show it to you. Here we go. Check this out. Coming into the dining room. You're good, just kidding. I already said I'm looking out with my friends, so I'm gonna keep you out. So we're coming here into the sitting room. And you can see the gorgeous doors off here. This is again to the courtyard. Built in 1922. Check this out. They're in the kitchen, so I'm gonna come in here. First of all, look, look at this. Big baseboards. Look at this room. Built-ins. And this has got a half bath here. There's a half bath, but you can see it's just really well done. You guys in the kitchen? All right, I'm gonna go upstairs. No, you, no I'll, I'll go upstairs. I'm gonna go upstairs. I want to stay out of their way because they're looking at this house. But I don't want to take you upstairs. But before I do, ah, these views. My friend said good sight lines. This home has beautiful sight lines throughout, meaning the curves, the angles, the painting. I should just be quiet and let you see the house. It is seriously one of my favorite homes that's of this age that I've seen. So this way is gonna be the master suite. Okay, so if we go to the right, this is our master bedroom sitting area. There's a closet on the right. Look at this. Toilet room uh, next to the tub, and then there's another closet here. Again, I want to be a little bit quicker. This is right out the back. There's a few of these. So you can see Edgewood Drive is right here. And Lake Collingsworth is right down there. It's got all pavers. Huge lot. Okay, so let's go back into this area. Maybe as I'm leaving, I can start turning off lights. So back out here, again, closet there. Let's swing around into the, down the hall here, which is a full bath. Really pretty. 
Check out the fan light. This is a tub shower combination. But you can see even some of the um, old but new. They kept they kept the original, but a lot of these are newer. Pretty floors, wood floors. This is a nice size bedroom. Lots of windows. Feels really nice in here. There's a closet there. Some more closet space, but again, I'm gonna be on the quicker side. So the other side of the house is over here. Let's go to the right. Let's go this way. This is going facing north. Even just look at some of the heavy uh, door casings, the thick, I mean, just that's how, hey, they didn't build them like they used to, as they say, this is solid. Okay, I messed that up, but they, 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 they still build them like this. If you can pay for it on a custom home, how can you get this on a production home? On a custom home, yes, but um, this is durable. Bath here, full bath. They kept a lot of the original look. They tastefully decorated. This is a tub shower combination. See all these little cool built-ins. It's just so neat. It's like a linen closet, but doesn't look like your standard linen closet. Linen closet. Then coming back this way. Again, another closet on the right. Nice size bedroom here. Windows and windows. And then there's another closet on the right. So let me take you downstairs. Oh, by the way, there's a closet here. We're not gonna open it. And a closet here and another balcony that overlooks the pool. So let's swing downstairs and go to the kitchen area. <laughs> that was awesome. You're gonna be on YouTube. Okay, listen, and now I wanna show you this kitchen. Look what they did. They had a broker's open here. This was just for us. I'm kidding you. I should have come to this broker's open. So this is gas. Look at the backsplash, even the hood here. Beautiful cabinetry, stainless steel appliances. You come around here. There's a, there's a really nice um, pantry on the right with the little um, arch and a fridge. So you can just kind of back up here and see. Beautiful kitchen, just enough space. And then you come into the yellow room, sitting area, dining, onto the pool. And we're eight minutes in, so we're gonna stop. Here's what I would tell you is that there is a apartment upstairs and then downstairs you have storage and a two car garage. But I wanna finish it off with this pool area because not many places do you see fountains with lion heads spewing it. It's really gorgeous. I hope you've enjoyed this video. My friends have enjoyed touring this house. This could be their house, I don't know, we'll see. Whether selling or buying, gotta call Brian.